Within TickTick, there's a concept called a smart list. If you look over on the left navigation pane, up at the top on my screen, you'll see inbox, today, next seven days. These are examples of smart lists. Another example is down at the bottom of this pane called trash. A smart list is basically a list that TickTick provides to you that's a filtered list. It has specific tasks or notes within that list. For example, the today list is going to have tasks that are due today. The next seven days are going to have tasks that are due within the next seven days. And the trash list is going to have tasks or notes that have been deleted. If you want to hide a particular list, you can click the three dots over on the right side and you can choose either show if not empty or hide. If I click the hide button, I no longer see that smart list. If I want to display that smart list again or pick other smart lists to show, I can go to the settings by clicking on my profile picture, clicking on settings, going to smart list, and here's the list of smart lists that are available to me and their current status, whether they're shown or they're hidden. And I can choose to change a particular list to either show or hide it from this screen. For example, the first list at the top is the all tasks. And as the name implies, this list shows all tasks. Right now, this list is hidden. From the drop down, I can choose to show that smart list. When I'm done making my changes, I click on the done button. Tick tick refreshes, and I can now see up at the top is the all smart list. I can choose to rearrange these lists if I don't like the order of them. For example, if I want my today list to be on top, I can click and drag it up to the top of the list.